blessed evening to you, my dear brothers and sisters. It's taking me a moment. This conduit has um, changed since I was last here. Sweet child, I am here with you tonight with my divine sisters of the white light. We bring our blessings to you, our love to you, our joy to be here. If during these meditations you feel a flash of energy run through you, know that Wind Horse Woman is here. She is never still. She's such beauty. Of course, my dearest sister, White Buffalo Woman, is by my side and soon will be joining space with me. Allow yourself to relax, to fall into meditative contemplation while I cleanse the energies. Of course, we purified this space, but there's so much, so much here in the planet. Breathe, relax, breathe and relax. Think for a moment about how you are connected always, always with your highest self always, always with the being that is the full you, who watches over the you who is here in this life. Always, you are one with yourself. Not through a physical cord, not through a coiled rope, but through the divine bond of love, the energy that flows between you the energy of love. Today, I invite you to relax, relax your senses, relax your being, relax your sense of self and open up, invite your higher self to come and fall in with you. Invite your higher self to merge with you in whatever way you are comfortable. Invite your higher self, say higher self, come and be one with me. It's as simple as that. Understand the more open you are and the more you accept whatever you receive, the more you will receive. That is a noble lesson for life, for all things in life, of course. Your higher self may be beside you, a seemingly as a friend, or a mentor. Your higher self may be within you or wrapped around you or whispering in your mind or gently caressing your chakras, your senses, opening your third eye, blessing your tongue and your words, enhancing your throat chakra, pointed inward as well as out, opening your heart Just know your higher self is always here, 
with you, for you, looking out for you. Imagine your divine brother, sister, amorphous being that is you. Open your heart. And as we go forward with our meditation, know that your higher self is with you. Your higher self is here in your being and always watching over you. Allow the top of your head to relax. Allow the top of your head to feel light and airy. Invite this airiness to percolate through your body, to flow through you, all the way down to your fingertips, down to your feet, flowing with light, airy energy. Did you know humans were not once so dense as you are now? Because once upon a time, people knew to breathe with every pore of their being. Remember this time so long ago. Invite all of your pores, all of your cells to breathe. And feel how airy you become. Like you are one with air as though you have just breathed yourself out and you are floating in the air ahead of your face breath there you are in front of you floating off dissipating think about it we each breathe we each breathe through every cell of our body. We are made more of breath than mass. So let yourself become breath. And let yourself float. When you are breath, you can expand. You can absorb beautiful energies as they come your way. And you can release all heaviness as it does not work with breath. Become breath. Feel how light and airy your being can be. Breathe. And imagine as breath, you may absorb all the beautiful divine love that is here ready to flow down upon you. Your light, airy head that is more breath than being. Allow it to expand outward, open, 
and you can feel from the direction of our brother sun, from our sister moon, from all the beautiful cosmic stars, light flowing down upon you, a shower of light, a gaggle of light, an essence of light. Allow yourself to refresh. Today we call the beautiful white light of the full sister moon to fall down upon us and fill our beautiful breathy shape as the light comes down from this, the beautiful final full moon of the year. White light is of purity and as such, it resonates beautifully with the divine feminine. Do not worry, this means you must be anything but what you are. The divine feminine is about nurturing, creating life, allowing life to rise up and grow forward with its roots planted in this beautiful, loving, powerful energy. Tonight we work with the Divine Feminine of nurturing, loving, nourishing growth energy. And we invite our sister moon to fill us with beautiful moonlight, beautiful love light, the pure cleansing white light. Let your imagination connect with this white light that flows into your being and fills you, that meshes with your molecular structure, your ionic bonding, your cells, your membranes, this beautiful white light of pure love, cleansing and clarity that flows into your being and connects with every aspect of you. If you were to look in the mirror now, into the cosmic mirror, you would see a being of divine white light looking back. Breathe this in. Feel the healing energy of purity and love. Accept this energy to every element of your being. Be one with white light. Be one with healing love. Breathe in light. Feel the light. Feel the glow that comes from this light. Directed inward, outward. Light emanating, white light filling your soul. Remember, when you are not in physical form, you are in energetic form. To bathe in white light is a common occurrence, a favorite activity. So remember, remember with your higher self's memory, times when you are nothing but pure, conscious, loving energy, and you bathe in white light, you feel purified, loved, divine. The beauty of love is here. Just breathe and be with loving white light healing energy resonating 
all through you and around you. Let this love flow through your heart. Let this love flow through your mind, through your chakras, through your limbs. Let this love flow. Feel the purity of love and know that this is you. This is your being, this is your heart, this is your state of consciousness, one that you may take and share with all that you come into contact with. All that you wish to send your thoughts to, all that you wish to send your heart to, your intentions, your goodwill, your charity, you may always be in this state and flow this energy to all who need it. All who wish it, all who crave it. And by this, I mean all, everyone, every being in all dimensions, all realities deserves love, is healed with love. Come with me now to an ancient place, a place of the grasslands that were once here, but long ago in a place before people were rampant, to a time when the animals ruled the planet and the humans were one with the animals. Come with me to the grasslands on this beautiful full moon night. And imagine you are beside me in these plains. The moon is high in the horizon, so bright and round. You believe possibly the stars that are springing around it are children of the moon. You have to look in other directions to see the stars clearly as the light of the moon is so bright. It is practically a cloudy day. The colors have shifted. In daytime, you see the greens, the pinks, the blues. But here at night, everything is in beautiful shades of brown, gray, black, shadow, and subtlety of light. Stand beside me and smell the deep aroma of the grasslands, the lush soil, the tall green blades waving in the gentle breezes. The smells of sweet wildflowers and wild herbs Everything is wild. Nothing has yet been tamed. Oh, beautiful times. And as you look through our beautiful, waving, rolling grasslands, you listen. You can hear the sound of some babbling water nearby. 
with just a few steps you arrive to a winding creek. It is deceptive as the creek carves deep under the ground to its left and its right. So that as you walk on the grasslands over the creek, you find the ground itself bends down into the creek. It's easy to fall in. So we must be careful with our steps. Possibly as we get near the water, we crawl on hands and knees for better stability. As the soft earth is cut through with water, you have creek, then on left and right grass, overloading, looking over the creek and in the center, a small rivulet of water that you can observe. If you lie flat on the grass, you can reach your hands into this running water and scoop up a cup and take a sip of pure, clean, mineral rich water. <sighs> Splash some on your face, the back of your neck, it feels so good. You can even stand in the creek. It is not so deep. Just slide down the grassy bank. Play your feet with the hard pebbles and the sandy dirt beneath the water. Do a little stomping and splashing. And if you put your left hand out and your right hand out, the grassy land is there beside you. If you look up, there is our sister moon shining her light full upon our faces. And with your hands resting on the ground, on the tall grass growing, for the land that cuts over this creek, you can feel a faint rumbling. Someone is coming. For curiosity and safety, scramble out of the creek, up an incline, climbing up a tree. You're a fast climber. Climb up and you look, you see an entire herd of bison coming towards you. They're not ru running and they are not strolling. They are enjoying an evening's walk. As they go past you, where you are safe in your tree and you watch them walk past you. It's not a large herd, maybe 50, 60 of these beautiful, magnificent beasts. They're aware of your presence. They have no fear of you and they have no need to give you fear. We are all in peace and harmony as neither of us are predator and neither are prey to the other. They are merely enjoying an evening stroll and wish to go further down the grassland to where the creek widens to a watering hole. You stay safe and secure in your tree as the bison pass until the last one comes to your tree and says to you, Hey, hello you, you young human. Climb down and rest upon my back. 
you may join us. You do so. It is amazing how easily you're able to scurry down the tree and from the lowest branch easily glide onto the top of this very kind bison's back. And you ride in comfort to the watering hole not too far up ahead where your friend the bison joins the bison herd and says to you, stay on my back and we will have a merry evening of it. As you near the watering hole and your bison wades in, drinking deeply, you see the small ones prancing and playing. And across the watering hole, you see other animals as well. There are some ducks nestled by the shore, other birds. There are many low-lying shrubby trees that house a number of small mammals and fowl. You see the bright staring eyes of a great cat who knows better than to attack anyone while the bison are here. So all the small animals are comfortable playing with the protection of your herd. Your bison says to you, Hold on, hold on tight. We are going for a ride and you do so. Your fingers beautifully gripping the long hair of this wonderful, muscularly taut creature. Your heart singing. And your bison goes for a run, runs across the plains, runs up a butte and leaps. Instead of going downward, you find yourself going up, 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 flying past the trees, past the clouds, up past many stars that are flashing around. You go up and land on Sister Moon. Sister Moon is the higher self, the soul of your physical moon. Sister Moon is teeming with life and white light loving energy. Sister Moon is the ultimate for soul cleansing, for cord cutting, for grand release, magnificent manifestation, and the purest, kindest, gentlest love. Your bison lands on Sister Moon and invites you to also land with your feet on this beautiful soul planet. You slide off your bison's back and allow your feet to sink deep into the pure white energy of Sister Moon. The bison drops to its feet as do you drop or to your knees. 
and then both of you fall forward and roll around in the cosmic dust of the love of Sister Moon. You become covered like a pair of glowing ghosts of pure love with the dust of our divine sister, the mistress of manifestation, the love and kind Sister Moon. And then you hear a voice, a voice that says to you, I am so grateful that you are here visiting me. Sister Moon welcomes you with open heart and open arms. Fill yourself with my energy. Let my energy absorb through you as though you are a sponge and I am your moisture. Let me infuse you with my great joy. Inhale me. Become one with cosmic love. Now pick up a handful of this moonlight as you had earlier scooped a handful of water. Pick up a handful of moonlight. Wash it upon your face. Pick up a handful. <sighs> Inhale it as though you were drinking the water. Pick up a handful and scoop it into your heart. Absorb. And then Sister Moon invites you again. She says, look into your heart. Fill your heart with love. And if there's any heaviness to be found there, invite this heaviness to absorb even more love. Is there any heaviness that wishes to climb out of your heart to be released? Look into your heart and ask, what is trapped in here that is ready for release? Communicate with your heart. Is there anything else that is ready for release? If there is fear, understand all that is released here is returned to its place of greatest joy.
There is never need to fear when you are healed with love. Ask your heart if it has any requests to help it to absorb more love and to send this love even further into your being. Understand now that you have connected with Sister Moon and her healing energies. This connection is here for you whenever you wish. Whenever you wish extra love, extra healing, Invite Sister Moon into your heart. She will bring her magic. And now your friend the bison invites you to slide onto its back. And again flies through the air to bring you back here to this time and this place. Here to your modern era. But understand also that in your heart is the magic still of the old days. We invite you to bring the love, the magic, the beauty of the old days through your heart and to send it out to this modern world so that we may help heal what needs healing in the here and now from the ancient magic of old. Let yourself fill and percolate with this love. We thank you for your time. We appreciate and value you. It is time for us to leave, but we leave with tremendous gratitude that we have made this connection with you. And we invite you to go forward in your life with love and joy. Farewell. Oh, wow. <laughs> I just saw the time. <laughs> oh, no wonder I 
was getting a little tired towards the end there, and now I see. I didn't realize. It... I thought this was like 10 minutes, so. Thank you all so much for joining me tonight. And uh, I wish you all happy full moon, happy holidays, happy new year, happy manifestation. Have a wonderful, wonderful time.